Hello there, in this video I'm going to explain you how to set up OBS Twitch and the, the software you need to enable streaming from Ableton in, onto Twitch and make sure you have audio coming from Ableton. So, <clears throat> first of all, you're going to go on Google and search for I show you audio capture. You download this, you install it, you will go through the necessary steps. If you have doubts, there's actually a whole explanation here how to install it. It's pretty straightforward, but read through this if you're confused at some point. And then you're going to go to audio MIDI setup, uh, command space to search for that. If you know, you can search here, audio MIDI setup. Once you're here, you're gonna make a new device, create a multiple output device, and you're gonna select um, the I show you, which is a new uh, device that you we've installed, and your default system. So, in my case, I'm using an interface, uh, and many of the people using Ableton are using audio interfaces. So I'm using the Solari, I have a couple, I have the Universal, the M920 and the Solaris, but uh, in this case I'm going to be using the Solaris, which is my main interface for listening purposes, and I'm going to also select that. So basically what I'm doing right now, I'm setting up a device that allows basically like a summing of two audio outputs into one device. So my multiple output device has two outputs summed into one. I mean, it's not technically that, but it's a way to comprehend it. So I've done this. I'm going to call this, uh, for example, my Twitch output. Then I'm going to go ahead uh, onto Ableton and I will choose the output to be Twitch. So what happens now is that my output is going on to uh, I show you this and my Solaris which is my interface. So why are we doing this? We are doing this because OBS on Macintosh will not, let's open OBS, will not detect your desktop audio. So let's say Let's put an audio track here. My OBS will not detect th that as desktop audio because it just doesn't work. It's, it's one of the problems with OBS. And we need OBS in order to Twitch and stream. So if I just keep it regular, like going through the Solaris, and I press play, and I loop this so you guys can see, there's no audio coming into my mixer here. So that gets solved by going into the options uh, of OBS uh, and I will put a link to how to install OBS and then on the audio you are going to put as mic auxiliary audio to the new device which is the I show you audio capture. You're going to click on that, make sure that on Ableton or Logic you have your new device which will be Twitch in this case and now when I press play it will be detected by the I show you device onto OBS. Uh, that's it. N then you go to Twitch account, you make a Twitch account, and you're gonna go onto your settings and then channel and videos. And you're gonna copy this link and go to the settings of OBS, stream, and put this link here. Select your platform and then put the link, press OK, and it should be working and it should be able to stream through Twitch. And it will be capturing the sound of Ableton and your mic if you set up the mic on OBS. But uh, for the purpose of this, um, Listen, I'm not gonna set up a, a mic because I don't I don't need it. I will be I won't be using a mic on the stream. 
uh, I will be connecting through chat. Uh, in case you wanted to use a mic, you just go to OBS and uh, set it up uh, here on the audio. And you, you select what, what you want it to be. So the webcam, it could be in this case, the whatever you're using.